greetings and salutations to all of you lovely people out there in YouTube land. Welcome back to another installment of Counter Reaction. So, in today's episode, I'm going to be taking a look at Gigi Delana's cover of Sam Smith's Unholy. This was heavily requested um, long before I even started reacting to, to Gigi. So, I'm expecting it to be good, but a bit of a disclaimer. I am not a fan of the original song at all. At all. So, I don't, I don't really know what to expect. I just wanted to put that out there because if I end up not liking the song or the performance or cover, there's some justification there. So, just, uh, just wanted to put that out there um, for the GG fans. Now I'm gonna do my absolute best, my absolute best to stick to just the music, you know, cause it's it's a little difficult. It's a little difficult. She distracts me and I'm not even listening to what she's saying. I'm just like entranced by, you know, her adorableness and beauty, obviously. So uh, I'm gonna do a good job of it this time. I think the last time I was like in and out of consciousness a little bit, <laughs> so. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best, but, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. Wait, no, no, no. quick man okay look i lied i lied i'm not gonna be able to do it i'm not gonna be able to do it i lied i'm sorry she looks great i love her hair it's super cute um her lips are popping like they look they look luscious they look extra luscious today well not today today but like then nine months ago that that day this sounds a lot different first of all so Different arrangement, different instrumentation, dope. It's a little bit more rocky, like rock-ish. Not rocky, like dun, 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 not that, not that rocky. But I like it. I really like it. On top of that, really quick, I just wanted to make mention, just one last time, that she is beautiful. Okay, that's it. That's it. That's all I wanted to say. quick so in in the through the fire uh performance right cover she was like in between the singing bits she was just really like adorable and bouncy and bubbly and having fun and she was smiling a lot she did she did that a little bit here but now there's like something a little bit more sexy about this performance and she's selling the performance. And I'm I'm buying what she's selling. Whatever she's selling, I'm going to buy it. You know, like, 
if I don't got cash on me, here's my credit card, my debit card, whatever you want. You want Venmo, you want PayPal, whatever you want, it's, it's yours. Um, but yeah, no, she's selling the performance, and it definitely is a lot more rock influenced. Obviously, everything's just just changed, and I think it's it's changed for the better, in my personal personal opinion. But she's crushing this performance, absolutely crushing it. And the band, GG Vibes, again amazing flawless flawless great great they are a a great combination for sure dude looks dude looks evil he's like he's channeling his his inner like slash or something i don't know what he's actually he's on the keyboard so it wouldn't be slash he was a guitarist but that was my first rock reference that i thought of <laughs> um let's continue You guys hear like the the nasaliness the that nasally notes i like that yeah there's a lot of nuances in her technique that i really really appreciate and god does she look you know she looks good that's all i'm gonna say she looks good she looks all right you know what i'm gonna go the opposite everybody just falls in love with her and melts over her i'm gonna be the one that that refrains from doing that you know so I'm just going to say, you know what? She's not even all that. She's not even all that. I'm kidding. No, I'm kidding. I can't let that rock. I can't let that rock. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do that. That little like the little sassiness, that little neck roll. Um, is that what it's called? A neck roll? I don't know what it's called. But but I like it. I like it. It shows a little bit of attitude, you know. Some some feistiness, if you will. I gotta keep my thoughts to myself. And when you need a baby, just drop it on the cover. Oh my god. I, uh, <laughs> hold on. I need to decompress real quick. Just real quick. And I'm going to keep my thoughts to myself. She's crushing this performance though. Like, vocalistically. Amazing. Amazing. Don't let my... I mean, I don't do breakdowns. This is a reaction. But don't let my reaction detract from how amazing her performance has been thus far. Don't mind me and whatever else is going on. Um, it's just throwing me for a bit of a, a loop. So... shredding shredding hell yeah bro you go look at you go bro i like that i like that
Okay, so there was a moment where she looked into the camera and I had to, I had already paused it and discussed just like, you know, other stuff, right? Like as it pertains to her looks and how beautiful she is. So I didn't want to do it again, but okay. I believe that alone, look, look, she channeled her inner rock star and smashed this song. I prefer this cover over the original. That is just a personal opinion, of course. I think that this is a little bit more enjoyable of a listening experience, and it's not just because she's beautiful. No, I would actually listen to this as opposed to the original, not just watch the original music video that Sam Smith made. And I have nothing against Sam Smith. He's extremely talented. I just didn't like the instrumentation of the song. I didn't like the lyrics either, to be quite honest with you. They're, the lyrics in this song, because of how they're delivered, are a lot more palatable for my ears. And I liked it a lot more as a result of that. And plus her voice, I kind of just prefer it. And, you know, I don't think anybody can blame me for that. So where does this one go? Playlist, no list, blacklist. Yeah, no, this is this is gonna go on a YouTube playlist. If they had an actual studio version of this, which I know they wouldn't because of copyright and licensing issues, I would much rather bump this on Spotify than, than Sam Smith's version. And that's the last time I'm gonna mention that because I've mentioned it like four or five times already. And I don't know if there's some psycho Sam Smith fans out there watching this video that are gonna wanna, you know, come knocking on my door and I just don't want the smoke right now. I don't need it. Life is beautiful. Life is great. I get to react to GG like whenever I want. I don't need to spend the rest of my life behind bars. I mean, I kind of already do. I write so many of them. But uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. It is greatly appreciated. And I do hope to catch you all on the next one.